Good morning, everyone. Let's do this. This is something I've been meaning to do for a while. We are going to make a Linux Gamecast Weekly Episode 293 with KDN Live. I don't know. Let's see. Version 17.12.3. That rolls off the tongue. So what do we have that goes into making this nightmare trade? Basically, we have the segments. That would be Steam, News, Hate. And that's our three main segments along with the chair acquisition, which is chairs. And with that, they have the accompanying just audio wave because we record a secondary audio stream. Those are synced up for the same time codes. And then we have transition bumpers and a couple of other things that we stick together. We're doing this um, as it's recorded. 720p, 60 frames per second. So... And all the clips, anything with a P on it, you can see is proxified because even on a 1700 with 16 threads and 16 gigs of RAM, scrubbing through 720p video can get a little chuggy at times. So let's get started with this. Um, with KD and Live, I'm assuming you're kind of familiar or maybe just familiar, curious. You have video tracks, audio tracks. We don't do a lot in KD and Live. Pretty much everything we do is um, live to tape with switching. So I'm going to need the MKV, which is the video, for Steam, and the audio. You know, I have the waveforms enabled. You can see the differences in the uh, processed audio. You can see it's a bit higher. I've uh, normalized it quite a bit. So what you're hearing in the background... There is just the audio being scrubbed. I do have two audio tracks, so I'm going to mute the video audio track. And let's just double check, make sure it's lined up right, because that is sometimes an issue with KD and Live, but those are synced correctly. So let's get started. I'm just scrubbing through, looking. That's our clap test. Which is helpful, because if you ever lose audio sync for any reason like that, you can always go back and check. Okay. That's me, so we're going to clip there, and... Alright. So, that should get us started. We need our intro, so I'm going to add... Let's see... Main intro... Need to create a new main intro. This one is totes old, as the kids say. Let me cut that down just a bit. You should still be able to hear it. I run that normally to five seconds in. And I clip it there. Alright, so. Alright. And the audio is going to be a little chompy. That's just how it is with KD and Live when you're scrubbing through. So we have that. All right. And so we'll be coming out there. I'm just going to drag these and sync them up. So. All right. I want to take that back. A lot of this stuff, I just ballpark. It is not... Okay, so there I'm going to add a dissolve transition. A lot of dissolve transitions in this business. Let's take that down, take a look at it. Welcome back to another Linux Gamecast week. Okay, that works. Um, let's see, a fade. We'll do a fade out for the audio on the main intro. Come back to another Linux Gamecast Weekly. The show covers the latest Linux gaming news, reviews, how tos, and most importantly, whatever the hell else. Pause, and then we had Hell Elks. You ever wondered what that looks like and you didn't want to catch it on the YouTube? So we can just squeeze that down. And. Whatever the hell else we come up with. Th That's that. So basically, that takes care of our intro. The next thing, which we don't necessarily have to do, but I'm going to do it anyway is the Steam update of the week. I'm just scrubbing through. 
looking for okay here we go oh man i can't even follow that up it's the stupid there we go and i'm going to clip the audio i'll show you how we used to add echo effects <laughs> hang on Linux. you can see that oh, we, we can do the echoes <laughs> live now but i'll show you how we used to do it i would just isolate that clip that and we'll do copy and paste that so we have the audio and let's see did i do the add the steam update of the week mm, no i didn't so let's add clips there we go and pop that in all right so now we'll have Transition to dissolve in and dissolve out. Now with the echo, what I would do is just doubling the audio. The reason I did a copy and paste because I used the socks with echo because regular echo just doesn't sound that good. And so I would just add socks echo and to make it sound not as hard when it comes in and out just fade in and out so we should have follow that up it's the steam hang on Linux update alright that's that now we have that segment done so we can screech all the way to the end and and that's where Jordan ends, so we trim off the bits. Shift R, ladies and gentlemen. That is something you do learn. Then we have our transitions. That's what the B chairs, B hate, B news. That is all that is. So we'll move on to the news. Let's get that in. Have news and audio so let's just cut to eyeball that okay. um, dissolve in so we have that let's see what the lead in there's pedro so let's trim the news Take it to about there. Sync that. There we go. Mm, that that that's a transition. That that's a pre-rendered clip that went a long time ago, and it works. So we have the new segment, and so we had to do for that. So we can go all the way to the end and clip the ends. And on to the chair acquisition. So this one does actually require just a little bit more work. Um, so we have chairs video. That because you might remember our original chair acquisition bumper, which we don't use. We stack that. This doesn't introduce much of a problem, but what we want to add is a chair dance, which I just kind of pick a spot, trim it down. It's different every week if you go back and look. We want that to come in. Acquisition again. About there. So this has audio on it, which we don't want the audio. So what are we going to do? We're going to go to audio correction and we're going to mute the audio track for that clip. We want the audio from 
the bumper reel. This would be simple if I would just re-render it, but somehow in my mind I've told myself that this is simpler. But I want to get rid of chair acquisition and have that video, so I just disable video for this track. Again. And that's what we end up with, but we do want, again, another lovely... Super classy dissolve transition because that's all I do to keep it simple. All right, and let's scrub. There's Frank. All right, that's Jordan doing the intro to the chair acquisition. So we'll trim that. And again, I am salt to taste on these and just kind of. Um, yeah, that looks good. So let's trim the end off that and we'll add um, a transition. Oh um, man, we were just watching Frank Burn. Okay. That is it for the chair acquisition. Now on to the okay. tape. I think it would be a good rage okay. Just get the ends off this. And to the hate mail. We're already at an hour and twelve. Jeez, that was a long episode. We've all, I don't think we've done a two hour episode yet, but I know we've tapped on it. That is definitely a thing. Let's see, chairs. that into the timeline and uh, the audio so okay oh man where did I do the chairs again I have chairs on the mind let's do hate let's do the right thing so you could, uh, you definitely should try to sleep more than two and a half to three hours, and after doing a twenty-two hour day, um, come on, brain, work, heat. There we go. Now we have heat and heat up. But there we go. Wash, rinse, repeat. Let's cut the beginnings off. There's that. And like we did with the news segment, just going to clip that in. I'll just, just kind of double check and make sure. There was one version of KD in live that when I did the snap, it did not line these clips up correctly. So I just, I have trust issues is what I'm trying to tell you. Well. And I had to go through a... Pretty significant re-render, which I was not happy about. So we'll put the dissolve in there. Oh, look at that. There's that. It's pretty much our hate mail. Now we have to take care of... We have the penguin. So what am I looking for? I am looking for the cue the music. Because things won't quit exploding, so we can buy that stupid tablet so we can do it live. Right. You wonder why I do that? That's that's why I do the arm motion, so it's easier for me to find it. That's where we're going to cue the music, courtesy of John O'Pakin with the free software song. We'll bring that in. That's obviously going to be too loud, so we will do keyframed volume. I don't have a hard and steady rule for this. I'm going to say about negative 25 dB on this. Let's give it a listen. It's time to cue the music, because you can always find us. That's right, for the Take 200 that up to third time. Around 9.30 Eastern Standard Moon Time. Just type that in Google and be like, what the fuck are you watching telling you to okay, type well, that I'll shit take it to I'm 21. We'll want to do a fade in on that. And that'll give us... There is that. Let's clip off the silence and we will add our closer. 
Five dudes. Which... I think I need to nerf about 8 dBs-ish. Let's take a listen. Sweet Jerry. Five dudes. Yeah, maybe not. Let's try five. Dudes. That's Cage. the gold this week, Jerry. Five dudes. That's it. All right. Boom. So we want to fade to black and fade out. That's the gold this week, Jerry. Five dudes. Boom. One hour and 20 minutes of happy fun time. I think that's it. I just got to give it a... Yep, see, I missed a... Dissolve right there. It's always go back and check your business before tapping the render button. That's that. Okay. Dissolves the mutes. That's good. News is good. That's our un unnecessary echo, but it's there. Why not? I wanted to show everyone how to do that. Not an advanced thing, but there you go. And our hell elks. Brilliant. That's how we make an LGC weekly. It's a lot simpler than the six to eight hours it used to take of editing uh, a few years back. Um, with rendering, I do have a custom MP4, which I don't use anymore because I use KDN Live Multi-Render. Go look that up. The only thing I've added to make it custom is the Mob Flags Fast Start, which kind of puts the extra bits at the beginning of the video file to when we upload it. It allows streaming instead of having to download the whole thing. A lot of people don't think about that. But what I typically do for this, I would generate a script and it would just do a lossless export. So it'll be, you know, 70, 75 gigabytes. And from that, it'll be lossless video, lossless audio. And I'll use Handbrake to break it down into an HD, SD videos that'll get uploaded to linuxgamecast.com and post it on YouTube and... After that, I would just export a wave, pull that into Audacity, double check it, make sure everything's fine, export that as an MP3, and that's what most everyone listens to. But, okay, um, I don't know if this was informative as much as it was just a behind-the-scenes thing, but I wanted to do it for patrons. You guys are watching it. You guys are going to be watching it at least a week before everyone else, so... Hope you dig it. Hope you found it of some use. It's brilliant. Maybe you can use it to go make some cool shit. All right. Die to fire. You know I love you. Old Man Vin, out. <laughs>